All right, guys, we're going to add some new LJN Wrestling Superstars items to the book. We've got some new vintage stuff to add to the collection, and we're going to do that this week on Federation Nation. All right, guys, welcome to Federation Nation. I am Anthony. This is Collector's Entertainment Network. And as I said in the intro, we're going to add some new stuff to the book, some new old stuff to the book, but it's new in my collection. But before we get into that, guys, I'd like to ask you, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, because I'd love to have you back. Please comment down below. Let me know your LJN Wrestling Superstars memories. Guys, please share this video with anyone you think may like it as well, and go ahead and give this video a like. Because that helps a lot too. Alright guys. So. For anyone who has been watching the channel. They know what this book is. For those of you who may have missed it. Or are being uh, introduced to the channel with this video. This book is my book from when I was a kid. It has all my wrestling stuff in it. Like my LJN stuff. It has cards in it. You know like uh, match cards. Like so here. Let's just take something here. WF. Wrestling from November 9th, 1988. And I've got written down, you know, that's over here. SD Jones um, and Junkyard Dog versus Ted RCD and Terry Funk. Uh, I see title match Paul Orndorff, who was, I think, the champ, versus uh, Ricky Steamboat. Uh, Hercules Hernandez versus Jesse the Body Ventura. So, like, there you go. I've got my first... WrestleMania. I've got all my wrestling cards. Here's November 15th, 1988. Uh, Hercules and Jake the Snake versus Roddy Piper and Jesse uh, Ventura. Just some awesome stuff. All right. But what I also have in this is not just the wrestling cards that I had back in the day. And this has kind of come out. So I can just show you. Is I have this. This is my got page where I wrote down when I got basically everything all in my little kid handwriting and there's some other random stuff on the back but back when i was a kid obviously you could see that this is pretty full so when i was a kid i started got to basically the stuff that i got in like 1989 the later stuff that i had received and i wrote it now this is when i got things and a lot of the times where i got things not always where but anyway so recently, I had just finally, after so many years, I hadn't added to the LJN collection and since I was a kid. I got uh, short-haired Andre the Giant, which I never had as a kid. I never had short-haired Andre. I never had the white or yellow shirt Hogan, like the 88 ones. And I never had any of the 89 lines. But I had everything else. I had everything before 89 and those two Hogans. And also just not short-haired Andre. Because I had long-haired Andre and... I just, you know, if it was, if I saw two figures at, 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 um, you know, at Toys R Us or whatever, one was short-haired Andre and one was a wrestler I didn't have, I always went with the wrestler I didn't have. Anyway, so I finally got him. So I didn't want to, like, write on the paper that's been there since then, but I figured I could add, and I made, got three. And this is, like, random stuff. And all I have in there right now is short-haired Andre, uh, September 7th, uh, 2023, from eBay. Well, I got a few more items that I want to take a look at. So let's get into that right now. All right. The first things, things, yes, plural things that we're going to show you. Uh, this right here should give you a hint. You've got JYD, uh, you know, the full figure and his Bendy, Big John Stud and the Bendy, Hillbilly Jim, Bendy and Rowdy Roddy Piper and the Bendy. Now these are all mine from when I was a kid. And Piper, you can see it's just destroyed. Like, I white, I put white out on him. I drew on his face. But this is my Roddy Piper from 1987, probably. Um, so, this should give you a hint. And then also, this right here should give you a hint. So, what did I get? I finally have the other... I have the thumb wrestlers for these guys. Now, the first LJN thing I ever got in my life are these. 
Hogan and Sheik, uh, thumb wrestlers. And I, I don't remember exactly when I got them, but I, I'm pretty sure I got them before I got any wrestling figures, like, you know, the full figures. And Roddy Piper, right there, that's my first figure ever. But anyway, so all I had was them. And then, um, I don't know if I got them in 86 or early 87 or something, but those are the first LJNs I ever got. And then by the time like Christmas 87 came along, I got a, I got a bunch of figures and I got a bunch of bendies. And I never really bought the thumb wrestles again because I had a lot of bendies. I don't, I don't have all of them, but I have all your basic ones. You know, none of the later ones, but all your basic ones. You know, like I have a few more, uh, but you got Hogan and Orndorff and um, George Steele there. I got Andre somewhere. I got Nikolai somewhere. I have all those, um, but I didn't really ever get any more thumb wrestles. Well, that changed... From the good old eBay. I got these guys in thumb wrestler form. I got uh, JYD. Let's see if we can sit them right there. I got, uh, let's do it in order. I got Big John Stud. He's all in pretty good shape. I don't know if you could see. There's a lot of light, but they're all in pretty good shape. And I, uh, who's next? I got Hillbilly Jim. Now, of course, this is the only hat I have because Hillbilly Jim Bendy didn't come with one. And the figure I got secondhand from a kid in town and I never actually got the hat. So I am on the lookout for that. Uh, there's Hillbilly Jim. And Hot Rod, Rowdy, Roddy Piper. And if you could tell, he's got the yellow. I know some of them came, they were written in red and some were written in yellow. This happens to be one of the yellow ones. So what we're going to do is we're going to put that in the book. Now, interesting fact, I got them. I ordered them on eBay and all that stuff. I got them, and I got them on March 29th, 2024. But as as everyone who's watching this knows, that March 29th is WrestleMania 3 day. So that's kind of cool. So this is the first entry. I've got one more thing I'm going to show you, but let's do it. Let's put something officially in the book. So... Let's just put it, hmm, let's put it down here. All right, so we got uh, Piper, Hillbilly, and I'm trying to do it like I would have done as a kid. JY, you know, not full things. Although I'm writing on the lines, which I probably wouldn't have done as a kid. I would have been all over the place. Uh, and and uh, Stud. Stud. Thumb Wrestlers. wrestlers and it was 3 29 24 ebay and we'll circle it and there you go another edition i don't want everything to slide out another edition officially in the book there you go piper hillbilly jyd stud thumb wrestlers 329 24 from eBay. Got something else I got to show you, so let me get that right now. All right, guys, that other thing that I got is pieces to the Hulkamania workout set. I got the headband. Very cool. I got the grippers, right? There you go. And I got the wrist bands. So this is all, I think it's also under the Wrestling Superstars um banner and i think it was also made by ljn so i'm definitely going to put it in the book so uh we've got hulkster we've got um the you know the grippers and we've got this so let me put this down and then we're going to get the book and we're going to put that in the book all right i've got the book here now i sh i showed you that i where i wrote down where i got those from which was ebay right some random person on ebay um and i showed you you know like i i would write in here where I got a lot of things. So I got, um, you know, Jimmy Hart from Woolworths. But I also wrote when I got it from somebody, I would write who I got it from if, you know, if it was a friend of mine or something like that. Now, I won't give out any of those names now. But one name I am going to give out is where I got those, um, the Hulkamania workout set pieces. I got them from, and if anyone's watching this, they probably know and probably watch Jason Nup on the new 80s Revolution YouTube channel. We have been friends, you know, like online buddies and friends uh, for a couple of years now. We're always sharing things and stuff like that. He had that 
on eBay and I want it. So I could say from eBay, but I think I want to put it uh, down that I got it from Jason Nup. That's right. Jason, if you're watching this, you will be immortalized in the notebook. Can you can you handle it? I, I'm sure this, this is a great honor for you. Um, you know, if you'd like to make a speech on your channel, I'd love to hear it. But I, I know that having you, having your name etched in stone or paper and pen, whatever, but having it etched in this book, I just know is an honor for you. So let's get to it. We're going to put, let's see, right here, right towards the top. Headband, wristbands, and grippers from Hulkamania, Hulkamania, workout set. It's a pretty, it's a mouthful here. Workout set, all right? From Jason Nup, the new 80s revolution. Here we go. Let's take a look. Jason, I know, wipe away the tears because I want you to take a look at this. Look at this. Ah, if I can hold it right. Headband, wristband, grippers from Hulkmania workout set from Jason Nup, the new 80s revolution. Take a moment. Take a moment. I know. It's big. I know. I know. It's big. You're in the book. You are immortalized in the book. And it's so fitting because all my LJNs were in a box in the basement for years. Uh, well, in different places. I moved from one place to one place. I mean, not that many moves, but four or five places since I moved out of my house that I grew up in, you know, an apartment here, an apartment there, and they always kept moving. And then we moved to our house that we own that, you know, I bought with my wife and it's our family house now, but they had still been in the basement for a few years after having, I said, been in a closet or been here or been there, been in storage, wherever. And it was watching Jason's, uh, LJN videos. And I was like, I, I got to go downstairs. I got to break them out. I got to get them. I got to get them. I got to take them out, see if they need to be clean, whatever. I've got to get them out. So I got them. I, I knew where the box was. I knew I had them. I knew where the box was. So I got the box. And then as I was doing it, I think the top of the box was all the posters and then the figures. And then as I was digging through, this was on the bottom. And now that I forgot about it, but I wasn't sure that I still had it. So when I saw that, it was amazing. And in fact, I was already, I think, uh, talking with Jason through Facebook. And um, and if not, maybe that was the first thing. I sent him a, a, a picture of this and he lost his mind. And uh, he he's even talked about it on his channel as well. So, I would obviously have had the figures and I obviously would have had the book had it not been for Jason, but they might still be in my basement. I might not be enjoying them. I might not have them out. I might not be going through it. I might not be talking to you about it. If I didn't go down there and be like, that's it. I, 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 I gotta get these out and I gotta, you know, see them again after 30, 30 something years, probably. All right. So there you go, guys. I got the thumb wrestlers and I got the Hulkamania workout set stuff. Um, again, from eBay, and that was also from eBay, but also from Jason, the new 80s revolution. And if by some chance you're watching this and you don't know him or watch his videos, go over and watch and subscribe. You're going to absolutely love it. All right, guys, that's going to do it. I can't wait to add something else. I think maybe I'm going to do a video soon where I go over all the things I need. And I'm sure there's a million things and variants and stuff, but the things I need, I basically want to complete... The figure collection, which could be expensive. I want to complete the thumb and bendy collection. Maybe not so expensive. Some are, some aren't. Um, I want to complete the card and poster collection. And of course, any accessories. And I think the only accessory I really need for figures that I have is Hillbilly Jim's hat. I think I have everything else.
Um, so yeah, that's what I want. So I got to figure out what it is that I need and make checklists. And maybe we'll make a video about it and we'll talk about it. Maybe you guys got some stuff. We can make a deal or whatever. All right. So that's going to do it for this week. Guys, again, please subscribe if you haven't already. Please comment down below. Please like and share. All those things help the channel. Uh, and it's so greatly appreciated. All right, guys. That's going to do it for this week's Federation Nation. So until next time, guys, have a good one.